this is the beauty when you start building million, million five, two million homes, right? Mm -hmm. We're here at the Partners in Building. And Josh, I'm so happy you took time off. There's nobody here, but you came here today to give us a preview. Yes. I, I really do appreciate that. Uh, I know this is the favor you're doing for us. But one little tip. You said it's this is the outdoor setup, right? Yeah, to do your outdoor kitchen. You're saying it's not a good idea to have a refrigerator uh, in your outdoor kitchen. Why is it that? So if you're going to utilize it constantly, then it's fine. But if okay. you're going to go out a couple times in the summer, throw a party and utilize it, yeah. the refrigerator is going to run constantly through the summer. So they burn up, you know, a couple years, a few years, you'll be replacing it. Oh, wonderful. So I suggest, unless you're going to constantly use it, don't get it. Or have maybe unplug it so it's not burning. Unplug it, okay. Yeah. Oh, okay, when you're not yeah. using it, uh, Yeah, unplug, unplug it. it, okay. That way it, it's not burning all, all through the day. All through the day, yes. uh, yeah. Wonderful, okay. wonderful. Okay. That's a good tip, because I always wonder why people have it. And 80% and of the time, they don't use it. They don't okay. use it. Okay. Usually has cobwebs in it. <laughs> and greatest the slot for it. Oh yeah, the definitely. Slot for it. Keep the fridge inside. When you want to use it, you bring it out and plug it. That's the risk. Yeah. That's the that's the risk risk management contingency. <laughs> you can create a space for it. Right. But you put it in the house. Mm -hmm. Whenever you're using it, you bring it out, put it here, and plug it in. Yeah. So it's same like plugging in on off. So the easier way okay. we put a switch on the plug. And you can just switch it off okay. and leave it there. Okay. Wonderful. Yeah.